everybody, my name is Aegis and welcome back to the Fire Ring that is Red Hail Gaming. And welcome to Meditation of a mo Mobile Device. I don't know what this game is about, I'm guessing you have to find your purpose in life or something. It involves meditation, which that's what usually happens. Whoa, that's a big snake. Okay, so, yeah, I don't really know what happened. What this game is about, I think I found it on either itch.io or Game Jolt, but I'll leave the link in the description below if you want, if you guys want to play this game yourself. Okay, so let's get into this. journey to find a deeper meaning in life than making selfies and texting. <laughs> Come to a massive graveyard of books to search for answers. A massive graveyard of books, you say? Okay. I'm an obsolete discarded smartphone. Okay. I get, okay. Climb the stacks of books to collect all the deep thoughts. Beware of bookworms and poor battery life. <laughs> bookworms. I can see this episode is full of book puns, isn't it? How funny. Oh man, every child's worst nightmare, a poor battery life. Okay, let's get into this. I don't know. I guess those are the deep thoughts. So, it's WASD, crouch, jump space, shift is crouch. Okay, I'm guessing those are the bookworms. Let's get up here. Here. So yeah, I don't know why a smartphone is trying to find its meaning in life, but uh. The face of a child can say it all, especially the mouth part of the face. There we go. Oh, just barely made it. No, that doesn't mean I made it. it just means that. Okay, here we go. Let's just. No, no, I'm getting going lower than I want to. I don't know how the bookworm can get me, but I guess it's a violent way if, if it can get me. There we go. Okay. Woo. One thing a computer can do that most humans can just be sealed up in a cardboard box and sit in a Boom. house. Just hopping from book stack to book stack. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I already was, I was already up here. Dang it. Boom, let's get up here. Okay. So, I noticed that no one commented on the, uh, well, only one person commented on the live stream. Thank you, Savage Song Hacker, uh, for leaving a comment saying to do the live stream. When you go in for a job interview, I think a good thing to ask is if they ever press charges. What? Why? Whoa! Oh my gosh, that was close. That was really freaking close. So these things like climb the piles of books or something? Is that what happens? Woo! If you go parachuting, and your parachute doesn't open, and your friends are all watching you fall. I think a funny gag would be to pretend you were swimming. What? Why? Um, 4 out of 10? How many other deep thoughts? Oh, there's another deep thought. Okay, let's get up here. How do I get up here? No, um. Here we go. Get up here. There we go. We're getting up here. Man, this battery life isn't poor. It's actually kind of good. Instead of trying to build newer and bigger weapons of destruction, we should be thinking about getting more use out of the ones we already have. There we go. That's a good thought. If you guys can't hear it, then it's on the screen, so... If you're in a war, instead of throwing a hand grenade at the enemy, throw one of those 
small pumpkins. Maybe it'll make everyone think how stupid war is. And while they are thinking, you can throw a real grenade at them. <laughs> it's like, it's like, hey, look, the pumpkin. Boom. You're dead now. If you ever accidentally drop your keys into a river of molten lava, let them One, go. Two. Because, man, they're gone. Because, man, they're gone? Well, I think that if you accidentally dropped your keys in the th Wait, why were you near the lava in the first place? That's my question. <laughs> because stuff. That's why I was near the lava. Because stuff. Stuff caused me to be near, be near lava. Many people never stop to realize that a tree is a living thing. Not that different. Whoa. Tall, leafy dog that has roots and is very quiet. Okay, now I see what those things are doing to me. They're damaging me. If you're Here we go. And your pants fall down, I think it's okay to laugh and let your hostages laugh too. Because come on, life is funny. Okay, boom. What? Oh my gosh. The music's getting too loud. I was right there. Sorry, level comp- What? Yeah, okay. Fine. I'll get all the deep thoughts this time. Did I have too many deep thoughts? Am I not? Am I? Not, is it not good that I'm becoming a sentient phone? Take and think. Home is where the house is. Yep, that's true. Home is where the house is. Also, home. I don't know if anyone's seen Thor Ragnarok, but if home is basically where the people are. If trees could scream, would we be so cavalier about cutting them down? We might, if they screamed all the time, for no good reason. Come on, get up the book. Come on. I never thought I'd say this sentence, but just jump up the book. Here we go. Because come on, who wants to wash clothes on the last day of their life? Not me, that's for sure. It's like, what are you gonna do today? This is the last day of your life. Ah, might as well just do some laundry. My wife's been bugging me about it, so I thought I might as well just do that. It's like, but it's the last day of your life. Yeah, I know. I might as well just do laundry anyway. It's okay. Here we go. Almost there. Almost there. <laughs> I've heard that one before. Whoa. That one was like really close. Seriously, stop damaging me, bookworms. To me, it's always a good idea to always carry two sacks of something when you walk around. That way, if anybody says, hey, can you give me a hand? You can say, sorry, got these sacks. What the? Did I, did I shut them up? Did I shut her up? Okay, come on. Get over there. Where's the, uh... Oh, there's a brain. I'm only five in? What the heck? Okay, is this an apple phone or banana phone? Here we go. For mad 
scientists who keep grains in jars. Here's a tip. Why not add a slice of lemon to each jar for freshness? What if I, what would happen if I fell into the mouth as the thing was just coming up? By the way, why would I need the crouch function? What good, what, what good would that do me? I hope if dogs ever take over the world and they choose a king, they don't just go by size. Because I bet there are some chihuahuas with some good ideas. Because I bet there's some chihuahuas with some good ideas. Yeah, that's true. There probably would be. Seven. Okay, this is going to be eight. Then that one over there is going to be nine. You're Siri. And I can picture us attacking that world because they'd never expect it. You're Siri, you wouldn't expect anything. You mean you wouldn't think anything. Perhaps if I am very lucky, the feeble efforts of my lifetime will someday be noticed. And maybe in some small way. They will be acknowledged as the greatest works of genius ever created by man. Well, I mean, Steve Jobs is one of the greatest geniuses in the world, but... Because, I mean, he invented Apple. Not the fruit apple. Why does it keep saying sorry? How is that still my best time? I got... Okay, well, anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like, subscribe, and a comment saying what game you'd like me to play next. Fire Ring, Red Hill Gaming. I will see you guys next time.